Hey guys and girls, welcome back to another episode with me, Luke, where we talk about all things crypto. So in today's uh, episode, we will uh, look at three pieces of news and then analyze the Bitcoin price. I also did say that I would be working on a separate video uh, looking at and diving into uh, gaming cryptos. So jumping into the news, the first piece of news is the about Ethereum. Ethereum price at risk of sharp decline unless ETH clears this heavy resistance. So Ethereum is struggling to stay above the 1,600 support zone. The price is trading at the moment below the 1,650 dollar mark. And there is a major bearish trend line forming with resistance near 1,645 on the hourly chart. But don't be surprised if we go down to 1,600 and potentially, um, like the article says, revisiting uh, the $1,500 level. So it's something to keep your eye out. Me personally, again, it's not financial advice. Do your own research. If Ethereum drops down to those levels, I'll be buying a lot more. Other news, holding XRP is more profitable than trading it and a recent analysis from a prominent crypto pundit Somai reveals how long-term ownership of XRP proves more profitable than active trading and I agree with him. Uh, altcoins are very volatile and personally there's no point um, trading altcoins because during the bull market the potential is 10, 20, 30, even 50x. So with XRP as soon as the law case with the SEC is finally settled. Expect big things for XRP. Other news about Avalanche, AVAX, the price surge sparks frenzy. Can it conquer the $10 barrier? And Avalanche showcases a bullish trend nearing the $10 resistance level from September. A surge in the open interest of positive indicators suggests potential for a breakout past the $10 level. And we can see this. If you're filling your bags with Avalanche, then why not? It's currently trading at $10.60. And from its all-time high back in um, 2021, it was trading at $146 a coin. And now it's, I mean, it's dropped down about 90%. So again, if your dollar cost averaging into this project, then why not? But again, do your own research. So that's uh, just quick updates about Ethereum, XRP and Avalanche. Looking at the technicals of Bitcoin, like the last few days on my channel, nothing is happening too much. It's quite boring. We just keep going. Okay, we're steadily um, rising. We've formed a higher low here. Maybe we have a higher low here. Um, but it is Friday, so the weekend, not a lot happens over the weekend, so we could just continue going sideways. If we do pump over the weekend, then we will obviously form a CME gap. What I'm expecting is the weekend to be boring. We maintain the same levels, the 27,500 or 27,600, and then on Monday, let's see what happens. So nothing really to talk about uh, today in terms of the Bitcoin price because of the weekend and on my previous uh, videos you can see my technical analysis there. So maybe expect to pull back over the weekend back down to the 26,500 or we just maintain uh, the same levels. So again guys and girls thank you for watching this very short episode. Over the weekend, I'll be working on a separate video looking at my first uh, gaming crypto and diving right into it. So again, thank you for watching, guys, this week, and I will see you on Monday. Have a great weekend and I'll see you soon.